100% full disclaimer, yes, I'm a partner of the funding booth, and yes, we want to help you out, but before you buy a semi truck, if you got the bad credit, try to fix it. If you don't have that much experience, I would say get as much experience, do your due diligence, because trucking is very risky, and being one of you, I want you to succeed in this world. So just know that. Just because you can do something, doesn't mean that you should. What's going on, mother truckers? Welcome to the Asia My Show. So you want to buy a semi truck? You might have bad credit. You might have no CDL, and you might have no experience, man. I'm here with my partner from the funding booth, the owner himself, Bob Booth. How you doing, brother? What's up, everybody? I'm doing well, man. How about you, Alex? You hanging in there, brother, with everything going on in South Florida? Hey, you already know, man. I'm coming back from that COVID, so you know I was dying last week, but I'm like that phoenix. I just came back and rebirthed, you know. <laughs> I hear you, brother. I'm happy to happy to have you back in the fold, man. I was worried about you for a couple of weeks, but um, we're back, man. Thankfully, right? Hey, that's what's up, man. So let's get into this, brother. So, you know, for people that have no time to watch a video full of fluff, we just want to give you the info that you need and why you came to this video. Okay. Uh, first off, can you give a little bit of your background? How long have uh, you know you've been doing this so people know who they're talking to, brother? Yeah, definitely, Alex. So um, you know, I'm the the president of the funding booth. Uh, we've been in business since 2018, and I've been helping out uh, truck and trailer financing uh, for the past seven years. So a lot of experience with uh, with that. Uh, specifically experience with owner operators, first time buyers, investors, um, and folks with all different types of credits and situations. So, um, you know, when the bank typically says, says no, um, we're able to say yes. And when I want, when, truthfully, Alex, when a lot of other non-bank lenders say no, uh, we're still able to say yes. So, um, you know, I'm happy to chat with you today about, um, you know, the different options depending on uh, the situation and scenario for the particular customer and um, really to see if, um, you know, we're happy to help anybody out there that, that may be in need. Hey, that's what's up, man. So definitely, man. Uh, now, here's the thing, right? The first myth that people have is that when you have bad credit, I mean, just straight shit credit, I mean, is there really anything that you could do for you know the, the mother truckers out there man is there any options for them 100 percent. there's there's options believe it or not for those folks um you know they've got to keep an open mind that's first and foremost alex um if their concerns are with regards to you know the rate and you know how little money they have to put down probably not the best time for them to consider buying a truck um but if you do have a passion and you've got the the lanes that you can ride and you know, you know, you can go out there and make money. Uh, for a lot of folks, it does make sense. Um, when you're when you're talking about the poor credit situations, a couple things uh, matter. Um, you know, whether or not you have your CDL uh, right now, how long you've had your CDL for, and you know how much money you can put down. Um, because we're talking about bad credit situations, um, your credit really isn't too relevant. Um, but what it really revolves around is is this: if you're a, a first time owner operator. Um, non-homeowner, um, you're basically looking at uh, anywhere from 30 to 50 percent down. Okay. 30 to 50 percent down, really? 30 to 50 percent down. I know it sounds wide, a wide range. Uh, I know it, it sounds high, um, but I don't want to sugarcoat it. If you have poor credit and you're purchasing your first truck, expect to pay 30 to 50 percent down. Okay. Got you. Um, sure. Yeah. No, that's what's up, man. And you know what? Uh, to be honest, people, uh, you know that I always want to take you down the right path. If you're buying your first truck, especially, you know, I always say don't buy a new truck. Buy a good used truck if you can. You know, as far as that truck, do your research what you can. But when it comes down to it, 400 and 500,000 miles in this economy, you could get a 2016 Freightliner with 400, 500,000 miles. You know what I'm saying? And so you get them for about 30 G's. So the real number you're looking at is anywhere between, you know, 13 to 15, you know, uh, G's somewhere around there to save up. Right. Yeah, pretty much, man. Um, all day long, we're able to help out those, those folks. And, um, there's really no minimum credit requirement with those, no home ownership requirements, nothing like that. It's, it's a single one page application. We need the invoice and the specs on the truck. Um, and we need the customer to shoot us straight. Um, you know, if they have the, the 30 to 50% down, let us know what's available. Um, if it's something that you have to build over in the next couple of months, 
that's fine. We're happy to wait for you and, and you know work with you as you grow and as you build your accounts where it needs to be um, to be able to get that truck. Understand one of the biggest things um, that happens is the truck you had in mind, um, you know, maybe a month or two before may not always be available a month or two later once you have the money that you have down. Um, but ultimately, Alex, I guess the name of the game is that we're here to help, um, you know, when it comes to new owner operators, uh, whether or not they have good or bad credit. Uh, we have solutions for that. No, that's what's up, brother. That's what's up. So at the end of the day, people, you know, uh, we're here just to help you out a hundred thousand percent man and if you want to talk to me or definitely talk to the man himself i mean is that cool bob if uh you know the mother truckers they want to hit you up and they have questions and they might be almost ready to buy a semi truck you know can you help them out with that we sure can man yeah you can uh, you can email us an inquiry we can uh we can give you a shout um you can give us a call and we'll be happy to discuss uh, your particular situation um kind of what you have going on and and uh, whether or not we can help you out now and if we can't help you out now alex we'll at least tell you out you know what you need to do for us to be able to help you um you know so one way or the other uh, i think um you know we'll be able to give them an idea as to um to what the next steps will be um uh, for their journey i guess that's what i put it hey that's what's up man we are the music makers and we are the dreamers of dreams <laughs> Thank you.